You're not going to fix the link? No, 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 no. You want to put the link? If you put the link, I have to chop you. So you have to charge me? Yeah. Are you sure? When you put a fake nail on, you wash you. Yeah, but I just got them done. It doesn't matter, honey. So you don't stand behind your work? Good day everyone and welcome to today's video where I'm going to be doing yet another one star versus five star. But today we are going to be doing it nail version. That's right, I'm going to be getting these nails done by a one star place and a five star place. Yeah, I'm really nervous but also excited. I haven't got my nails done in a while because I've been trying to repair them and today we could be destroying them. So I'm gonna take a look at the one star reviews first, give you a little insight on <laughs> this salon I found. So before we get into the actual written reviews, I just want to take a look at some of <laughs> these damn photos. <gasps> oh my gosh. I assume that this was a removal. Could you imagine leaving the nail salon and being like, um, I asked for a removal and this is what they left me with? Cute tattoo, by the way. These chicken claws. Holy crap. <gasps> I can't tell if like their nails are super inflamed or this French tip, which is not a French damn tip, it's a French hole tip. Like is that pink the color they use or is it just so inflamed and like irritated? Also, oh, damn, that's crusty.com. Oh, these are chunky yet funky. I mean, it's kind of cool that they have these gold flakes. <gasps> This woman got cut. Holy crap. Yike a doodle damn do. Okay. Honey, you better not chop these fingers off. Thank you. Why am I doing this to myself? I don't freaking know. Let's take a look at the actual reviews though. Cause you know, maybe just some bad pictures were on here. I wish I could give zero stars. Do not go to the salon. The worst set of acrylics I've ever gotten in my life. She didn't listen to anything I asked her and shouldn't even put tips big enough for my fingernails. I even showed her a picture. She didn't know what she was doing. What a joke. Another one. I would give this place a zero if I could. It is the dirtiest rundown place I've ever seen in my life. The stool they put your foot on is cracked and hard. The towels look filthy. Oh. My god, this place is not like clean. I feel like I'm gonna get an infection. <gasps> they don't even put any sterilization in the water. They don't put plastic lining in the tub that you soak your feet in. The tools do not look sterilized. If you want to get nail fungus, <gasps> go there for a kind of place that it is the place Ugh, I can't even speak. If you want to get nail fungus, go there for the kind of place that it is. The prices are absurd. Oh my gosh, why am I doing this to myself? Oh my god, another one that says, this place deserves a rating of a negative zero. When I first walked in, I was already very skeptical about staying because the salon looked pretty dead and the workers just looked very old and tired. Nevertheless, I wasn't going to judge a book by its cover. Oh, this is long. I don't have time to read that whole damn thing. Trust all the reviews and do not come here. I wish I would have read the reviews before coming. <gasps> And here I am, little dumb old Joey, about to go get a freaking nail infection. Okay, work. I love you so much. Mwah, 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 mwah. Let's go. Also, hold up, before we go, I am going to basically tell each nail tech because when I go to the five star, I wanna give the same exact description that I give the one star of what I want. All I'm gonna tell them is I want unicorn inspired nails. This hand is going to be, cause it's my left hand, I don't use it as much, is gonna be the one star reviewed salon. Make it as unicorn a full as possible and we'll see what they come up with. Alrighty guys, so, <laughs> oh, I'm scared. Why am I doing this? I'm scared for you. My hand, what could happen? Am I going to lose my fingernails? I hope I don't witness you losing your fingernails. I think I'm my scarring. biggest fear is just getting cut because getting cut on your like fingernails and your cuticles, it's painful and it mm -hmm. lasts. Mm -hmm. And every time that you like freaking like touch your fingers on something, it stings. I'm nervous for the sanitation as well. There are a lot of comments about sanitation issues here. <laughs> I don't want you getting any 
fungus. Oh, well, I have plenty of fungus in me from all the freaking candida I have, so <laughs> more friends. For you. <laughs> okay, let's do this thing. We're gonna be also filming kind of like incognito, so the angles are gonna be undercover. a little sketchy. Mm. Yeah, oh my god, we're like little undercover spies. <laughs> Fun. Incognito. <laughs> Don't just hold your phone out like, whoa. We're not in there yet. Yeah. So we're not in the store yet. <laughs> Um, I have an appointment for two. Oh, for manicure, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, please. Okay. Can she pick a color? Oh, oh it's for, for him. Oh, oh, just for you, one manicure. Yeah. Okay. Interpretation of what a uniform would be. Or it's, like, uh, like rainbows and. Oh, you like, wanna do color? Sure, I mean, whatever you can do. Five. Go for it, whatever you think. Okay guys, made it out of there alive with my hand intact. Let's review what happened in there. As soon as we get in there, there's an altercation between another customer. Literally, we were warned. <laughs> yeah. That's exactly what people were saying is like- She walked out. Unprofessionals, <laughs> yeah, the woman literally walked out. So basically what I got out of it was she was trying to charge her extra for a nail. Yeah, she needed the nail fix mm -hmm. and they're trying to charge her more for something that they needed to fix because they messed up. It was um, quite heated too. It was, and the woman, like, I think she was the owner of the place, yeah. was not having it. She, she went off on the woman, mm -hmm. and then she walked out, and she was like, you need to have better customer service here. That's what the woman said? <laughs> yeah, she's like, it's not about the money, it's about customer service. I can't believe we actually caught that on camera. I know. How that must happen all the time. Yeah. God, these nails. She okay. was so sweet though. I, I felt so loved bad. my nail tech woman. So this is not like bashing her or anything. She was a um, sweetheart. She didn't know what a unicorn was, so I had to show her an example. So she decided to go with rainbow. The owner actually chimed in, was like, "Oh, I know a unicorn." So she picked out the colors, and the colors aren't bad. I think it's super cute. I do have some blue nail polish on me. <laughs> This one's a little bit scruffled too. Yeah, I actually don't know when that happened. Um, she touched them. She touched them. <laughs> That's when it happened. She checked to see if they were um, dry <laughs> and she ruined them. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so she touched them to see if they were dry. So they green and purple. So this one was super duper chunky. When she put it on, I was like, oh, yikes. And then she put a clear coat on to cover it up. Looking up close, these really aren't well done. Um, lots of paint on my hands. But it was only 10 damn dollars. So 
I mean, you get what you pay for. Salon could have been cleaner too. Yeah, when she was scrubbing me with that stuff, I was like, oh, <laughs> that's when I got a little scary. She was a little rough, but at the same time, she was also gentle at times. So I really enjoyed her. I gave her a tip. I think overall, it was more about the professionalism and the atmosphere in the salon as opposed to like the work. I mean, yeah, and they were a bit desperate. You could tell they were like desperate to keep that one customer and it just resulted in aggression. Oh, is that what it was? I don't know. It's just very aggressive desperation mm -hmm. rather than actually wanting to sure. keep their customers well. I mean, if you have a one star reviewed salon, you got to work on it. And like the customer's always right. The customer's that's, always right. That's what they have to learn. Cleanliness, customer's always right. And I think they could take it up to maybe three stars. Oh, okay. Well, two very important things. I say we head to the five star salon and we'll compare what a five-star salon unicorn nail looks like compared to this okay so now it's time to look at the five-star reviewed salon oh my gosh those are beautiful honestly if they were to do this for my nails that would be considered unicorn and I'd be very happy honestly the iridescency of it all I am very triggered <gasps> Oh my god, gorgeous. Guys, I'm so excited. Okay, this nail, mm, not so much. Wow, okay, they are talented here. Hopefully I get one of these artists. Oh, that's pretty. It's like a freaking crystal on a nail. Holy crap. So far, I'm feeling very confident. Oh my gosh, these marbled nails. Oh, they're gonna do so good. I'm so freaking excited. I have so much faith in them, but also with these expectations, you never know. As we know from the psychic one, you can't judge a book by a cover. Who knows what's gonna happen? Let's just read a couple of these reviews. Now I wanna read some of the reviews. The pictures look amazing, but let's get the facts. Best manicure in LA. The Super Gel is an incredible product. It lasts for weeks and is so strong. The salon is clean and inviting and efficient. I'll never go anywhere else. Okay, work. Oh, wow, okay. I happy, I happy. I happy drive an hour to get the quality art and friendly service. Their work is consistent and my manicures look as beautiful on day 14 as I do when I leave the salon. Totally worth the hour I drive. That's good to know, because I'm gonna be driving about an hour to get there too. You know what, I've heard enough, let's go. Alrighty, so we're about to head in to the five star rated nail bar, and I am very excited. Do you think it's gonna be better? I think anything will be better than that. Honestly, if I did this, it would be much better. Oh my gosh, okay. The last nail tech I went to, she um, checked to see if they were dry and she was like this. And... Hold them. <laughs> 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 okay, are we cutting your nails at all? Just a little bit, just a little trim spa. Oh, five really star place, so. This is your competition. Do you think you can? <laughs> you know, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not really they, sure. They didn't know what unicorn was, so. What do you, where did you go? <laughs> 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 No, I'm fine with like stones and like crystals and whatever. Like I've done some pretty crazy stuff to my nails, so I'm, I'm used to like some gems. I was like planning on the other oh. hand too. <laughs> I was like, okay, so I'm gonna put another one over there. Gorgeous. Wow. So good. Thank you so much. You guys should get in on that trend, the wrinkle trend. Alrighty. So ho 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 ho. Now that's someone who knows what a unicorn is. I'm very impressed. I'm very happy with the results. She gave what I asked for. It was very professional in there. Everyone was super friendly. Oh yeah. Great service. No fighting. No. <laughs> no, no, no wrinkly nails. My nails are completely smooth. Oh my gosh. So I'm gonna pretty. come back and get the same thing. I'm obsessed. <laughs> I'm jealous. Oh my god. So I love the iridescency of it all. Here, I'll give you a guys a, a close-up shot in just a second, but I just wanna say definitely five star equivalent of what I was expecting. Overall, very happy and 
So now I need to figure out what happens with this hand. Look at that shiny, shimmery, splendid. I love the fact that there's actual unicorn horns on here. Although I will say, if I were to change one thing, I think I would have done a silver gem instead of the gold, but you know what? Still looks good. So now that the second hand is done, I want to do a side-by-side -side comparison to really compare and contrast what a one star and a five star result looks like. Can you guys guess which one's the five star, which one's the one star? Well, I'm back home now and I wanna see if uh, some people at my house can tell the difference of the one star versus the five star. So let's go find Miss Maria and see if she can tell the difference. What's going on? I wanna see if you can tell the difference with my nails. With your nails? Yeah. So I went to a one star nail salon and a five star nail salon. Okay. So you have to guess which one. Which hand? Yeah, which hand is from which. Oh boy. Okay, I'm good at this. Let me see. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Ready? Well, this shebang is one star. <laughs> this shebang! <laughs> Why? Shebang is one star. Why is it one star? It looks star? like it's made by me. <laughs> In the backyard, I'm sorry. I hope I didn't offend. I hope that's not a five star. No. That's less than one star. <laughs> less than one star. <laughs> Even Why? I can do it better. Why? Blind and <laughs> old, rot old rotten eye and floaters. <laughs> what? what makes you think that? It just doesn't look cool. I don't know. It's smooshy, smashed. <laughs> it's <laughs> It look like crinkle blinkle. <laughs> crinkle blinkle. <laughs> I don't know. And do you like this one? I like this one. This is yeah. this is cute. Don't tell me this is one star and no, that's five. No. You got it. How much did you pay for that? Ten dollars. And get money back. One dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Not even one dollar. It's ninety-nine cents the color. And this video did a hundred times, right? It's like what ten cents? Oh my god. <laughs> yes. Okay, well there you have it. Hi, mister. Hello. I have a little task for you. Hmm. So I just got my nails done from a one star salon and a five star nail salon. Oh, look here. Lark, do you want to guess too? She knows the tea. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. Oh, oh my God. This is, looks like you painted it yourself. <gasps> ah, what do you Wait, mean? Wait, why is it so I smudged? <laughs> Everyone's been asking that. Which one do you think is which? This is definitely five star. Yes. Because it has little like nail gems and yeah. iridescency. Oh. This literally looks like the hand from Dexter that they find in the ice <laughs> with the icebox killer. Put up a picture right here. Really I does. hate it. She hates it. Oh, them. which one? She Mark? sniffed it out. Look, oh, she, she, she bites my out. finger off. <laughs> Good girl. Yeah. While it was drying, the woman was checking to see if it was dry. So she went like this to my nails. <laughs> <laughs> she just like dragged it. Did she not redo it? No! What a dumb no. I gave her a $5 tip. Oh good, yeah. for your troubles. <laughs> for my troubles. Okay, so I think it's pretty clear that uh, there's a difference between the one star and the five star. Lesson learned, actually listen to the Yelp reviews for nail salons because uh, sometimes the tea is a little too hot, but it's the damn truth tea. Honey, I still can't get over the damn wrinkles on this hand. I don't know what else there is to say. Case closed. We know which one was better. The end. Well, anyways, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you slap that like button. It will let me know that you guys like this type of video and you want to see more. And also, leave a comment down below of what I should do next for a one star versus five star because I want to do this again. And also, if you're not already subscribed, hit that damn subscribe button. Go on, click it or tick it because I'd love to have you a part of my Wolfpack family. And yeah, that's it for today. Until next time, I will see you next time. Good damn bye.